Okay. Time for the game changer? Yeah. Okay, so I let's get so. to our game changer. We go to the ladies on the couch. Lots to talk about. Hey, ladies. Hey, yeah. Our game changer today is someone who's making a huge difference in thousands of people's lives, really helping them to live the American dream. We are so excited to welcome him here today. We've actually had, technically, we've had you on the show already. Yes, yes. but we had to know more. Yes. We had to know more. This is Beto Yarce, and you know, I have to just fill people in. I mean, basically, he has this nonprofit that helps people found their own businesses. And you came here as an undocumented immigrant. How did you go from that place to all of a sudden having your own business and helping other people create businesses? Well, I did that because I really love helping people, but I come from a class privilege in Mexico. They helped me to get where I am today. Mm -hmm. And I was able to navigate the system, learn how this work, the system work. And now I'm just giving back my knowledge to others who are in the same place that I was 16 years ago. And that's how we do it with ventures. I think what was really interesting about your story that we shared a little bit earlier on the show was the fact that it's a lot harder than some people think it is to go about the legal way of gaining status here in the United States. And some people who are going through your small business program are finding that it's helping them with that. Can you talk a little bit more about, about how it works? Of course, it's super difficult to become a legal immigrant in this country, but I think it's all about connecting the dots. So when you don't know how to connect or get in resources, it's harder. So what we do at Ventures, people know that they might qualify for an immigration status, but they don't know because they don't know speak the language, they don't know how to navigate the system, but we know how to do it. And when we take the opportunity to, to connect those dots, things happen. So, wow. but still very hard, but we need to do more of that, yeah. of connecting people with the, with the resources that are available on how do you become a legal immigrant. Yes, and let me see if I get the numbers straight, but since Ventures has been in place, you've helped found, what, more than 2,000 businesses? Yes. 2,000, think about that. Wow. How, I mean, that's just, that just blows my mind. So how does someone get, like if they want to start their business, how do they get engaged with Ventures? Well, we have a very robust and the whole ecosystem program to support uh, minorities and people with low income to, who want to start their business. So we do it with a business basic course and after people graduate from the A week, which is basically how to put together a business plan with marketing, financial and operations, they have access to incubation, access to capital, ongoing support, coaching, legal clinics, uh, everything that they need. We have a micro lending program from 1,000 to 35,000. 100% of our loans are repaid because we have a very good relationship with our clients. So that's how we've been super successful and our business are thriving because we help them from long term. It's not just one class, it's just like an ongoing support for them. So cool. If someone wants to work with you, what are the requirements and what is the process? Three things. So you need to be low income. So you need to qualify based on our uh, government incomes. So a family of three making less than $23,000, but we have the hot guidelines on our website. Okay. You need to be very clear about what you want to do. Okay. So just one idea. Entrepreneurs, so many times we have many ideas. Yes, so yes. One <laughs> idea is perfect. And, say, and third is like you need to have some experience on the industry that you want to launch a business. Okay. And if you are not there yet, we refer you to other organizations so that they can help you together. Why do you see small business as a pathway to the American dream? Why a small business? It, I call it economic mobility or economic opportunity. So a small business is a way that we can, we feel very proud of contributing to the society that we live, especially if you come from a generation of poverty or you have less resources in life. When you get there, you feel like I made it. And the United States is a place that is a lot of resources and especially for people of color, minorities, the people we have been left behind. So I think that business is something that you feel very proud when you say I own a business. And no matter what size of the business is, but you feel like I have seen all those faces of my clients that they come for the first class and then they graduate after a year and they are totally different people and their kids look at them like they're my parents are successful or that person is getting success. So I think that's what an American dream should be. And it's not just about dollar amount or the size of your business, it's that part mm -hmm. of how do we get their economic opportunity and economic mobility for all. 
Yes. Wow, you're like melting my heart again. <laughs> oh gosh, so how do we learn more about ventures? Do, do we have a, I don't know if we can ask my producer, do we have a keyword or should we just direct people to your website? Yes, please do uh, Ventures Nonprofit. Are, we are very active on the social media. We have a Facebook and Instagram and LinkedIn. And you guys also can find me on Beto Yarse and then you can find me. I'm very active okay. on social media. And you guys can find all the resources. And we have a lot of resources for entrepreneurs. So I just want to put it out there. We're the only nonprofit organization that uh, that kind of work in our area supporting low income entrepreneurs. Okay, and we're going to put a link in the hive so that there it's there go. as well. Yes. And you can see Ventures on the screen. So congratulations you. for all your success. Well, thank you very much. Thank I you. haven't done this by myself. Mm -hmm. I have a wonderful team of supporters that Ventures help. And humble too. I see. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> thank you, Beto. Thank, thank you for, thank sharing you for your the story. opportunity. Thank it. you for the opportunity. Right. I appreciate yeah. it.